Hello everybody, I'm the Lonely Loco and today's video we are going to be looking at the Tornado, which is probably the best train in the game, Steam Train. So here we have the locomotive itself. I can't hear anything. So quite nice on the outside and looks nice and If you put full regulator, now you can start hearing the brake pipe starting to charge, which is a f fantastic detail. And we're in the cab here, we've got the regulator here. I think put sticks on, here's water. Quite nice, quite, people say, well, it looks quite modern. That's because this thing was built in 2008. I'm trying to run down, actually. Another thing you might be able to notice is got this little gold counter by here. And just stopped, okay. Anyway, so we're running an excursion train which So we're going to add another train at the end. Um, we've got two to select from. Classic 6 or a Class 31. I think Class 31 will go better. And it's quite short as well. Yeah, that would make more sense. I was getting the 6 or 6 seat one. I forgot how horrible this was. See one is escaping. Right, so let's start. Quite a nice little thrash this thing has. And let's quickly shove on the brake. Turn it around. I don't dress for any lag, but like. Oh no. Sorry, passengers. But like, you do need to get out my train. No, I'm joking. We need them. Well, you did pay. You made the decision. Anyway, I think I've said it all, so. Things started up. Are we up to water? Yes, we are. And let's watch that. Oh, beautiful. What? Oh, my coaches are gone odd.
I apologize for what's going on. Uh, what the hell? I also quite like the little screeching that goes on when you stop the train. The game's putting an application for me, as you can hear. Let's whistle that up. Yeah, that's the bell if you guys are interested. If the doors don't close, um, I'm gonna make sure. Taking an awful long time. Which is quite annoying. Am I allowed to drive my train? Man, I've gone through a lot of drivers. Oh, I'm moving a little bit out the yard. Because um, we are like... Just for that very long wait. Oh, we're not going 37, 31. Bad luck. Okay, we could do it without coaches. We don't need train. How fast this thing can get up to speed wise. Right, we are off to a great start. See if I have my old skills still. Oh, right, this cap detail quickly is incredibly detailed. Got all the little panels up there. Got a little roof thing over, which I think is on the real one. I think those are your whistles. Got your speedometer, pressure gauge and stuff like that. Water looks pretty low, yeah. And it is. I'm gonna start cutting off. Oh, I love that feature. I love this. Close oh my god, the fire is lit as well. Oh, that's cool. Warning automatic air brake must be in operation before using straight air brake. Going into the tunnel. It's only about two pound or two dollars. Oh, little bridge. Smoke went right through that. Smoke's a little bit. Steam and smoke is a bit glitchy. But like, if you're like someone who wants a really detailed look move, this this is one. And when World Editor comes out, you can make like a own route as well. 
Turn up to the tunnel now. A little bit laggy, my game. A little bit of a bridge that was. Oh, that was fine. This is quite a beautiful um, route as well, Horse Junction. I'll do a separate um, review on that. <gasps> oh my god! Oh, oh, get off, get off. Uh, fr fuck off. AWS, AWS, AWS. Where, where, where's it gone? Where's it? <gasps> yeah. Hee 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 hee. If you don't know, any game that has this is my favourite game. It's a cute little feature. I don't know why I freaked out over it. Oh, we got a huge downhill coming up. Oh yeah, this part of the it's a bit of a smallish route. Right, I put thirty five percent. We're coming up to some sidings. I oh, will just pass the station. Should I have stopped there? Nah. Oh, we're bad shit. Oh, I should have busted the station as well. Oh. This is whistle heaven for me. If you don't know, I quite like whistling the bridges, you know. Because, like, people are there, you know. I don't like a trace button. I hate it. I hate it. When I'm on a bridge, try to sees me, and doesn't do anything about it. So, I always make sure I whis whistle on the bridges. Even though there's no people there, it's just like... Good habits if I become a train driver, which I hope to do. Bridge! I love, I love going over bridges. I'm all bridge. Do a long one, because it's a red one. Another one? Okay. Oh, got the little speedometer thing there. Quite nice. I mean, the smoke is a little bit puzzling, Steam. Anyway, this is a beautiful model. I'm gonna start coasting. I don't wanna go too fast, but this thing. I th in real life, it goes up to 101.3 miles an hour, I think, the fastest was recorded. Lovely BR green. Apple green, I think. Yeah, it is apple green. Let me check. Uh, yeah, it is apple green. And we're in the cab, apparently. There's a big AWS there, just standing there. Like, hey. Bridge. This is bridge heaven. Slightly open. Let's just give them the steam. Oh, signal box. Hello. Wait for it. I did it just for them. Anyway, time to put some braking power on. So this firstly is independent. Jesus Christ, that goes far. Oh, look at the pressure rising on that baby. Jesus Christ, that's some stupid. Strong, br um, dependent. I 
coming up too. Hmm? What? Excuse me? Bro, why did we stop? You know what I'm gonna do. A scenic photo. It's gonna coming out of the tunnel. I don't know what happened though. It just stopped. Now we're gonna see the smoke. Good thing about going slow, that you really get the smoke up, steam up and high. And we're clipping through. That's odd. Should be approaching a first as we approach our station. I was going to do a return journey, but um, this video took uh, quite a while to make. What the wheel slip looks like. It was a double chimney though. A little bit embarrassing. Just chop chop the throttle. Because I can use the term now. Little cows there. You can also hear the crackling of the fire. It's quite a neat feature on this locomotive. Yeah, we don't care about the last coach, as long as we get the train. So basically, overall, this locomotive tornado, and then, like, I don't know, Train Sim World 3 is, like, really good. This is pretty much the equivalent to Train Sim World 3. All we need now is for N3V to p put the um thing where you can drive the trains from the cab with that DUI oh you can help us translate trains into your own language well, that's cool anyway you can <laughs> drive your trains from the cab without the UI which is going to be a really fun feature and we're definitely testing it out but it's going to make this train 
real life. With that, I took you goodbye.